Hey guys, what is up? This is Proven Potter and you are watching Tech Unite. And today's video tutorial is about how you can fill the payout information in the, in the Facebook Instagram article. And many other people are asking me that after I complete the tutorial regarding the topic that uh, how to set up the Facebook Instagram article for WordPress, like the part one, part two, and part three. And many other people are facing lots of the problem and they are asking me frequently that how can I set up the payout information. They are facing lots of the problem. So I'll clear that problem here and in this tutorial is about all about that. So before starting the tutorial, please don't forget to hit the red subscribe button you see on the screen and press the bell icon so that you'll get notified of each upload from our video channel. Okay, so let's get started to the video. First of all, I'll go to the browser and just uh, type here developers.facebook.com then press enter when you go to the developers.facebook.com you will find here my apps just a uh, you will search for all the application uh, you will find here all the application that you have created in the facebook audience network so i have i'll set up uh, the payout information in i'll go to first of all i'll go to see all apps then you can find all the application here i'll i'll set up the Payout information in something like this application. Then go to the audience network as usual. Then you'll find here a payout. Click on the payout. Then click on the create of select payout. Then you'll find here create a new account and use an existing account. If you want to create a new account or you if you want to create a new account of the some bank account then you have to set up to create a new account and if you are if you are already set up if you have already set up the payout information just select this one and just I, i'm going to create a new one just click on the create a new account then you will find here first of all country just that you just have to choose your country i'm from the country nepal so i'll uh, select the nepal So you'll find here Nepal then you'll have to choose the account type that is the individual partnership or joint venture or something like you can find here I'll choose individual because this is my personal account so I'll choose individual one and many of the people asking me that who are what should I keep the tax ID number and uh, many of the country have the tax ID number in the international country like US and other country UK they have the tax ID but in our country like the Nepal India China they do not have the tax ID so uh, in the tax ID you can f fill the account number uh, some sorry just you can fill the citizen citizenship card number or voter card number or anything like uh, passport number I'll fill here the citizenship card number I'll fill the citizenship card in number and you still have to type the select the tax ID tab click on the click on here and just uh, click on other government issued tax ID I have uh, kept the citizenship card number so it is other government issued tax ID number so I'll select that then you just have to type here account name the account name means that uh, account name which is in the bank owner name okay this so I'll type the bank owner name or that is the account which is belong to the bank Then you just have to type here address. Then just uh, select the city. Then you can find the zip code or postal code of your city or country. Just uh, then select the province. Then type here email. Type your phone number and slide down and click on next. Sorry, here is the address is wrong, something like okay. Then click on next. You'll find here account owner that is a 
the account uh, nom nom account owner that is uh, if this account is belong to other people then you just have to fill all the information regarding data owner info okay as uh, so i'm this is my personal account so i'll type same information here then click on next then you'll see the information that is just uh, no need to fill the tax form click on the next then you can find the admin here you can add other people as the admin if you, this account or if this instant article is belongs to other people also you can make other people admin so that they can withdraw the account or with uh, withdraw the money from the account anytime so it's uh, uh, this is my personal account so i'll keep orbin but try the same and then click on the next then you'll find here account holder name if uh, you want to withdraw the amount uh, through the bank this you just have to fill the name of the account holder okay you see if you want to withdraw the money from the something like paypal then you can uh, write the first name last name and paypal email address i'll give uh, the bank account type your something like bank account holder name then type your bank name something like then you'll find here swift code many other people uh, of the country like uh, nepal they don't know swift code of east bank because uh, they, they are not quite familiar with this uh, other country people might find their swift code because uh, the bank uh, they will provide the swift code if you don't know what is the swift code then you can directly go to the google and search for the bank swift code if you are from the nepal i'll put the link in the description below that uh, swift code of some banks uh, or directly you can search in the google also so just uh, type here this swift code okay sorry i'll i'll keep the, the global ima bank global ima bank and the swift code is glb b n p k a Then you just have to type here the bank uh, account number. Then click all this information and read all this information and click on the finish. In this way, you can set up the PR information in the Facebook Stand article. If you still have any type of confusion regarding this topic, then please uh, leave all the confusion downside in the comment section below, and I'll try to uh, clear all the confusion as possible as I can. Then if you like this video tutorial please uh, give a big thumbs up and subscribe my channel for more video tutorial. I'll, I'll be uploading this type of video regularly more frequently as possible as I can and I will see you in the next video tutorial. Uh, until next time see you bye.